All right, Polygoners, we have our co-caster back. We have the Korean duo. They are going to be pairing up again. Maybe they'll make a Korean Archon. Maybe they will reunite the entire Korean Peninsula. Who knows? We will see. Anyways, we're going to be hopping in to our next game. But before we do that, please go on Twitter. Hashtag SC2Lives. Tell all your friends what you're watching, who is casting, who is playing. Tell them everything that they need to know about tonight's event because tonight we are doing a best of seven pre-show before our best of seven finals the best of seven finals will begin at 7 30 p.m eastern time and we have two amazing teams in the form of Cy Storm gaming versus the risen competitive community all that said we're going to be going to our casters now take it away all right, uh, well, I'm back. <laughs> Sorry, Sluggy, didn't, uh... That was an important I, phone call. You have to do it. And yeah, I, I just, uh, I, I hope you don't have abandonment issues, you know, because I, uh, I've been kind of uh, leaving uh, you hanging. I, I have I, to I hang in twice already. I learned to hide it. <laughs> oh, no, 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 come on. <laughs> don't, don't do that. I don't want to have to pay for your therapy lessons. I'm not that rich, you know? <laughs> I, I mean, I, I could probably pay for your therapy lessons in down payments, you know, like you know, uh, I'll accept that. <laughs> I'll, I'll accept it. <laughs> whoa, 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 I'm not paying you. If I pay you, you're just gonna take the money and run. I'll be paying your therapist. I, I can't. Well, we all gotta get money from somewhere. <laughs> oh God! All right, all right. Whoa, whoa! What do we have here? We have Mech Depot, and we are going to be starting off in the top right corner with our Psionic Aftermath Red Terran player. It's gonna be Jin. Spawning in the bottom left. It's from Nocturnal Gamers, undefeated Xenador. Yeah, let's uh, let's let's study that word for a second here. Undefeated. You know, he's been. I mean, he's been doing a great job of just killing his opponents. And things are gonna run in here. Is this Reaper going to oh. die? Oh my goodness, that's <laughs> oh, no, so that's bad. Good. You cannot lose your first Reaper that quickly, Sluggy. This oh. just might be, uh, <laughs> right. Oh my goodness, oh, and he cancels his CC. And the reactor could go down. This is horrible. I mean, did Jin just not realize <laughs> what was going on? I mean, oh, this must this must be extra sad for your Terran heart. Uh, heart. <laughs> oh, this is, oh, this is just bad. I I, I feel like, it, you know, if Jin's uh, if Jin's teammates had just kind of told, you know, Jin what what Zenador likes to do. Although uh, I, I yeah, think maybe the he chat had, uh, that there's yeah uh, hot yeah. key issue or something. I checked the message log real quick, and it seems to be the 300 ping that prevented the Terran player from moving his Reaper in time. Oh, there's a there's a huge ping, and oh, can we just restart? That was lame. Uh, I'm not sure if that's a live excuse. I don't think Zenador. Uh, I, I like that's not. It's not Zenador's fault, you know. Right. So right. if you're gonna do a restart, you obviously have to do it before the one minute mark. You, right. can't do a re you can't do a restart at 329, you know, it just doesn't yeah. happen. GG is called and Zenador gets three straight kills here. Is that an all kill? Was this a uh, one, Yeah, that's one more, right. It's just right. three victories so far. Well, wow. I just, <laughs> I'm, I'm blown away. I'm blown away at, at, I feel like Psionic Aftermath is... Just not having much luck today. Luck is just not on their side. They keep getting caught off guard by Zendor's very aggressive tactics, and now we've we've already yeah. seen three games in a row row where Zendor likes to end it. You know, even before the late game stage happens. Right, and it's uh, working out really well for him. But by now, it's been an established pattern, and uh, they should definitely know what's coming up against next. Uh, I preferably hope Xenador <laughs> switches up to a macro tactic just to throw the other team off balance now that they know the precise pattern that he's going to play. That would be a great tactic. It would be a great idea on Xenador's part to realize he's done three all-ins already and right. his opponent, his next opponent is probably going to be expecting it. And then he could do a mind game where he doesn't do an all-in. Right, that uh, going for like a gasless expand, that is something that is viable. And if the opponent just stays all turtleish and all defensive, that will be a great start. 
No, I, I agree with you, Shaft. How do you feel about that? Another quick game here from Nocturnal Gamer Xenador. Well, I think Xenador has definitely established a pattern. Actually, while you were gone, I was commenting on the fact that um, it doesn't seem like Sonic Aftermath has adapted to this guy's playstyle. I'm curious to see if, like, what you guys say is true. If, like, maybe he mixes it up to try to be, like, you know, all tactical. But so far, we haven't seen that much communication from teammate to teammate saying, yo, this guy's going to cheese the fuck out of you. So we'll see if that ends up coming out. Meanwhile, guys, buy some Crave Jerky. It's delicious. We'll be back after a word from our sponsors. If you want to be notified when we release videos like this, please make sure you hit the subscribe button. If you don't know where that is, I'm not going to teach you how to use the internet. There's probably no hope for you.
If you want to be notified when we release videos like this, please make sure you hit the subscribe button. If you don't know where that is, I'm not going to teach you how to use the internet. There's probably no hope for you.